Greetings everyone, I'm Dr. Anth. This video will be the first in a series that discusses the regional cultures of the United States of America. In a prior video, I stated that anyone raised in the U.S. had an American culture. But due to its large size, the U.S. also has 12 regional cultures. Most Americans, not to mention the rest of the world, are unfamiliar with these regional cultural differences. The United States is the third largest country in the world, after Russia and Canada, in square kilometers at 9,833,517 square kilometers. The U.S. also has the third largest population after China and India. Because of its size and latitudinal position, the U.S. has several biomes, or ecological zones. Until fairly recently, humans living in these different zones would have had very different lifestyles and would have fed themselves in very different ways. This map shows the native populations that lived in what is now the U.S. You can see that the various native groups overlap with the different biomes. Their cultures were quite distinct and strongly related to the type of biome where they lived. Beginning in the 15th century, groups of colonizers from several European countries began to settle in the different regions of what later became the United States. The 12 regions of American culture are the result of interactions with a specific natural biome, the native population already living there, the particular European cultural background of the colonizers who settled in that biome, and the cultures of the groups from West and Central Africa who were captured and enslaved by the European colonizers and brought to a particular biome. This map shows the 12 regional cultures. You can see that the regional cultures again overlap with the different biomes. I find the subject of the regional cultures particularly interesting as I have lived in several of them. I've lived in, starting on the west coast, the left coast, El Norte, the Far West, the Midlands, Tidewater, and Deep South. My father was born and raised in Greater Appalachia. My mother was born and spent her first 11 years in Yankeedom, later moving to the Midlands. This next series of videos will discuss the origins of each regional culture and how the regional cultures still impact 21st century America. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel.